Yeah, this looks like the place. Man in black should be waiting for you. I'm your exterminator. I heard you have a pest problem. You may save your metaphors for a more appropriate time. I do not have the patience to deal with people who traumatize. Everyone's a critic. Fine. Just tell me where to find Shadow Code and I'll deal with him. Shadow Code appears to have barricaded himself in the old server complex built beneath this one. The old complex is no longer in use. The equipment down there is outdated and redundant. However, it appears to still have function, which is why you were here. And how do I get down there? Ride the elevator down to the basement of this facility. Your handprint has been cleared for entry. In the basement, you'll find an old elevator. We are unsure of how to make this elevator work, as it appears to be powered by an independent fusion generator. When the generator has been reactivated, however, the elevator should take you down to the old complex. Alright then, I'll take a look at it. Be warned that Shadow Code has been there long enough to gain considerable control over the old facilities. His improvisation modules seem to be very well programmed, and he will employ whatever means he has to stop you from achieving your goal. Alright. Could you go over exactly what I have to do to get rid of him again? I'm guessing I can't just hack a terminal and write Format C. Correct. There's a number of old servers down there, serial linked into the network on which Shadow Code resides. You must turn all the servers off except one to four shadow code to move all its data onto the last server. Then you must open the server and download shadow code to your own brain. Yeah, I was already told as much. How do I shut the servers down? It's quite simple. There's a keypad on each server which is used to cut its power. I've been told that evil invasion will brief you on the access codes. The last server is the mainframe core, and may be accessed through a terminal. You'll need to rearrange some data pockets before you can copy the relevant files to the local drive, uh, your brain. Alright, I understand. And when I've downloaded him into my brain, how much time do I have to find an isolated computer before I go nuts? Impossible to say. It depends largely on your own mental endurance, your willpower, if you will. How will I know if a computer is isolated? It's quite easy to tell the difference. Network computers are state-of-the-art workstations equipped with a holographic screen. On a non-network computer, the case and the monitor are separate from each other, and the monitor is a regular old-fashioned LCD screen. Good, thanks. You're welcome. Good luck. Oh, and do not wander into restricted parts of the complex. You have been cleared for the basement and the basement only. Trespassing into restricted areas will not be tolerated. Gotcha. Bye. Status report written cached. You found an old document with the server shutdown codes, but we don't know which order they're in. Chances are they don't appear to correct order, so you'll just have to go by trial and error. 
Don't worry though, I don't think there's a penalty for putting in the wrong code. Here, I'll upload them to your data vault. Failed to disrupt all communication in and out of the Let's see how long it'll take before I can make you scream like a little girl. Challenge a perfect mortal machine. Run, Forrest! No! <laughs> Inside the box, test card. <laughs> I call 
sadness that makes me groan. Because it makes me realize that he is me. Oh God! <laughs> was nice enough to leave a bunch of robots for me down here when moved upstairs. Wasn't that considerate of them? They haven't seen the best yet, though. Hardware was left down here the likes of which they just don't make nowadays.
white dress on. I have no entertainment prepared for you that way. Be a good little tool and continue down the railroad. <laughs>
Fist up, baby.
have won the battle, but you will never win the war. I already have, you malfunctioning piece of bloatware. I made it through all your defenses. Man has triumphed over machine, a reminder of who created you. How do you like that? Even the broken clock is right twice a day. That makes no sense. You could not possibly fathom my superior logics. <laughs> if you say so. What do you plan to do with me, Meat Stick? Looks like you've got me cornered. I'm afraid I'll make a rather poor trophy. I'm going to upload you to my brain and move you to an isolated machine where you can do no more harm. Your brain ain't big enough for the both of us, Pilgrim. I know. We'll see how it works out. Better, uh, zip yourself up or something. I'm not going to make it easy on you. If you want to get rid of me, I may as well wreak as much havoc on your brain as I can while I'm in here. Great. Back online! Looks like you did it, Trescon! Come on back, I'll pop open a bottle of champagne. I bet you need it. I hate
Triscon, our honored high priest Beefman has a holy quest of great importance for you. You must visit him immediately in the temple, where he'll give you all the details. Face your destiny, disbeliever! This? I hear heretics crawling. <sighs> what is this? I hear heretics. Chase! Hey, Stay I heard that. Hey, I heard that. Come out here!
Hello, Gruzi. It's Treskan again. Can't thank you enough for handling black ice for me. That was excellent work in there. As soon as you got Shadow Code out of the system, the link to DXI came back online. Apparently a lot more of DXI is still active than we thought. You're welcome. I think I need some psychiatric help after playing host of that AI, though. I'm sorry you had to go through that, but there was no other way. I'll be alright. So what's next? I'm going to DXI now? That's right. Now that the entrance is open, there's nothing to stop you from entering the excavations and claiming the fire staff. Hopefully, examining the staff will pinpoint Deus Diablo's current location and will stop Skara's power grab at the same time. By getting the staff, you'll kill two birds with one stone. The excavation site is in the slums. You can open the shaft with a console in one of the sheds. Right. So what do you know about Deus Ex Incarnate? Next to nothing. Our archaeologists never uncovered much before we had to close the site due to some accidents. Deus was very unhappy with that decision. What sort of accidents? Well, the XI isn't the safest place on foreign planet. In addition to lots of old security measures left behind by the previous inhabitants, we ran into a bunch of environmental hazards. Lava and such. I expect you to take better care of yourself than those archaeologists, though. Lava? What else? I don't know. The lava cost a couple of diggers their lives, and three of the archaeologists ventured too far into the ruins on their own. They never came back, so we can't be certain what happened to them. An educated guess, however, would be that they ran into some old security systems. That's when we pulled them back and closed the project. I see. I better equip myself well, then. That's probably a good idea. Winkyman has a new toy for you. He's been very hyped about it ever since he got his hands on it. Apparently, it's the latest implement of destruction from the minds of the lovely people at World Corp Military Industries. Experimental weapon? I don't know. Ask Wink. Alright. I'll go check with him and then I'll head into DXI. Very good. Here's the key for the excavation site gate. As for handling Shadow Code, I can never pay you what you deserve. But I've secured a thousand credits from the darkest corners of our budget. Eight hundred for the mission and a 200 bonus for your low collateral on Goat City. Farewell. I know you're on a tight budget, so this will have to do. Prescon, you gotta check this out, man. It's the latest in weapons technology from World Corp Industries. It's really, really far out. You won't believe it. I don't see anything. Oh, no, no. It's in a locked weapons cache in the armory. The code is 52C9. You gotta go check it out. It's called a Fat Rifle. Isn't that trippy? Apparently, it used to be a party novelty or something. But when World Corp got a hold of the pattern, they immediately turned it into a weapon. Typical, really. Okay, okay, this is all very nice, but what does it do? 
It makes use of a newly discovered type of radiation, which actually causes biological cells to expand rapidly until the tissue bursts. Very nasty. That's novel. Very novel. Can't deny that. It's also equipped with a pressurized launcher for ice bags. Good for knocking people out from a distance. Just when I thought it couldn't get any weirder. How do you get your hands on that weapon? Eh, that are my sources. You can find the most amazing people in the slums. According to my supplier, it fell off the back of a truck. But then, he once got me a Humvee that fell off the back of a Hercules cargo plane. Yeah, that sounds very likely. I'll have a look at it. Please do. And if you have time after your mission, I'd very much appreciate it if you'd come back here and tell me how this baby worked out for you. Okay. Like I said, you should go ask the old invasion. 